Hey guys, it's me Wayne Chia. Hope you're doing well. So for the first time in the past year and a half history of me being publicly in the Malaysian mechanical keyboard scene, a gathering was held in Kuala Lumpur, more specifically at the Yellow Apron Restaurant in Petaling Jaya. This meetup, organised and sponsored by Cooler Master Malaysia, was open to the public, although registration a few days prior to the event was required. We were fashionably late by an hour, but I think we didn't miss out much. For about 20 minutes of our time, Cooler Master had given us a brief presentation on their 2017 lineup, specifically on their mechanical keyboards, because duh, it's a mechanical keyboard meetup after all. So the latest into the uh, CM mechanical keyboard lineup is the Master Keys keyboards with PBT keycaps. I was already expecting to see this introduced here in the event, as it did make its debut in CES 2017 a couple of months ago. It was really great to see their full Master Keys lineup, mechanical only, on display for us to get a closer look on what they had to offer. I really like their Master Keys LRGB keyboard which retails at 569 ringgit. If you're not into the whole RGB business, you can also consider their white LED only variant that retails at 449 ringgit. Of the Master Keys lineup, this S10 keyless keyboard with white LEDs is the cheapest, retailing at 409 ringgit. Also joining into the event, MSI had a live showcase on their gaming PC. Now, on to the reason why you are watching this video. More mechanical keyboard footage. Many keyboard geeks, yes, that's actually what we call ourselves, though I think literal keyboard warriors would have been more appropriate, many of us brought along our keyboards to be showcased to everyone else. Although arguably, the most intriguing of all is the Topo Switch board that got the most attention. What with it being so expensive, almost always over a thousand ringgit each and its distinct key press feeling. For myself, I brought along my 1992 IBM Model M mechanical keyboard. The keyboard itself was also a center of attention, so I had to pass it on to my buddy San to um, entertain um, whatever questions anyone else had while I was busy recording footage. And the keyboard that I am actively supplying currently, the Fulan 10 keyless RGB mechanical keyboard, which retails at 250 ringgit. If you notice in this video, one of my buyers, Afik, actually brought his unit as well. I would have wanted to bring my Lingyi and Orla mechanical keyboards as well, but unfortunately my personal demo unit was sold a few weeks back. In hindsight, I shouldn't have sold them off.
Interestingly, someone actually brought along his membrane keyboard. Not sure if the owner was trolling or what, or he had the wrong memo, but it's actually a pretty nice occurrence as it had a part in educating newcomers on the differences between a membrane and a mechanical keyboard. Oh yeah, I need to take some time to give thanks to Cooler Master for sponsoring the food and kudos to the person who picked Yellow Apron and Yellow Apron themselves. The food was amazing. Not surprising that some people actually typed free food as their main reason of attending in their registration form. We were all also treated to some exotic cakes. A little later, I crashed over at one of the serious hobbyists' table. 
Here, I met legendary Malaysian geek hackers Sam Yuxi, Joa Henza, and a couple of other guys I'm not too well acquainted with, but one of them is also a renowned artisan keycap maker. The board that I'm currently showing you right now is the Axon 65% custom board that is totally made in Malaysia. The group buy on GeekHack has ended but it was sold at a reasonable pricing of US$200 for the base kit and US$275 for the premium kit. Premium kit comes with your choice of Gateron yellow or black switches, a GMK key set and stabilizers. There were also options to additional parts at varying prices and an upgrade option to originative MOD switches at $40. If you're interested to learn more, link to the GeekHack trade is in the description down below. But if you're really interested in this, there is still some time until April of 2017 for you to join into this. Just contact me and I will give you the further details. Alright guys, that's my time. I hope you have enjoyed watching this video. If you're looking for a high-spec, low price mechanical keyboard or are looking for advice on your first purchase, please do not hesitate to contact me. My details are also in the description below. So until next time, take care and bye. Oh right, I've also forgotten to mention, all mechanical keyboards distributed by me comes with lifetime switch and LED warranties and one year manufacturer warranty against defects. Further details of the keyboard shown here can be found in the video description. Thanks.